Next speaker is a third generation Southern Tier resident. She and her family live in Farsalia, New York, in Chenango County, and she is the founder of the new Southern Tier anti fracking network, Save the Southern Tier. Governor Cuomo, four days ago, residents across the Southern Tier came together to form a new network called Save the Southern Tier. We did so because the majority of residents of the Southern Tier do not want to be the lab rats in a fracking experiment within our state. If fracking is unacceptable for New York City's watershed and other people's water, then it should be the same for us. We don't want to be poisoned, and the gas industry's bogus economic claims will never convince us to jeopardize our health. The numbers don't add up, and short-term boom and bust would destroy our local economy. The gas industry's own data tells us that 6% of well casings fail at the time of drilling, and 50% over 30 years. What does that do to our agriculture, for our organic farms? What does a heavy, industrialized, and toxic landscape do to our tourism industry? And what does it do to our property values? I don't want that to be the legacy for my son. As the mother of a one-year-old child, I must ask, why are we searching for yet another fossil fuel when we're in the age of an environmental crisis? I'm terrified of my son not being able to grow up. I'm a third-generation New Yorker. I've lived in Shenango County my entire life. My mom was born here. My dad was born here. I want my son to grow up here. New York State is the only place I've ever called home. What I fear most is leaving my son a legacy of abandoned gas wells, dirty water, and bad air. I'm here to tell Governor Cuomo not to poison mine or any other families, and to tell him not to create a toxic legacy in the state that my family has called home for generations. <laughs>